Hey, Judy and Rob, Black Panther has seven chances to win, and the Academy hopes movies like this will bring new energy to the Oscars. I talked with most of the cast last winter when it first opened, and one of the Warriors was recently in Chicago. So for them, it's all been a fantasy come true. Black Panther proved that a Marvel action blockbuster can be considered a work of art. It also shows Hollywood, a movie with a mostly black cast, can have wide audience appeal. Actress Denai Guerrera told me it's Wakanda forever for the players this awards season. And they're on to a sequel. We're in such a state of celebration. What's really awesome is that we get to spend so much more time together. We really are a family, and um, I just love them so much. I love those people. Bradley Cooper was in Chicago banging the drum for his directorial debut, a sweeping saga starring Lady Gaga. A Star is Born has eight nominations, including Best Picture. Gaga's up for her performance and Best Song. Sam Elliott gets a supporting actor nod. Cooper was snubbed for director, but he's up for Best Actor and Adapted Screenplay. This is a contender when Oscar time comes around. Did you think about that as you were doing the film? Oh my God, no. No, I was just trying to get uh, something truthful every day and then try to really make a story that, that I felt was the story I wanted to tell. That's, that took all of my day. And if you trusted love this far, don't panic now. If Beale Street Could Talk may win Regina King another award for her role, director Barry Jenkins could score his second adapted screenplay nomination. Who can forget the snafu that had the La La Land team handing over the Oscar to Moonlight? It's still a hazy memory for the filmmaker. With something like the Oscars, that, I was so inside it, you guys saw more than I saw. You know, I didn't see the car at the set Moonlight. I was just as confused as somebody sitting at home. You won't be confused this time if it gets a nod, right? You know, I think that um, what happened at that Oscars will never happen again. <laughs> we hope not. And congrats to Melissa McCarthy, who grew up in Plainfield. She is nominated for Can You Ever Forgive Me? Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.